In this video, we will see a solution for a common issue we face while transferring files using FTP. In our case, when we try to access another device using FTP, we get an FTP folder error. It says that Windows cannot access this folder. Ensure you type the file name correctly and have permission to access the folder. A connection with the server could not be established. We were trying to access our phone's storage using FTP, and we received this error. Let's try to resolve this. Search for, turn Windows features on or off, in the search bar and open it. This will open the Windows features box. It contains a list of Windows features that we can enable or disable. This is the list. Here we will enable .NET Framework 3.5. We will expand it. Here we will enable both of these checkboxes. We will expand this next Windows feature. .NET Framework 4.8 Advanced Services. Here we will make sure that ASP.NET 4.8 is enabled. We will click on the WCF Services checkbox. We will expand it. TCP Port Sharing checkbox is enabled. We will scroll down and look for Internet Information Services. We can see that the Internet Information Services checkbox is already partially selected. We will expand it. We will click on the FTP Server checkbox. It also gets partially selected. We will expand it. Make sure that the FTP Service checkbox is enabled. We will also click on Web Management Tools. Now click OK. It is asking for downloading some files. We will select the option to let Windows Update download the files for you. It is now downloading the required files. This can take some time, maybe up to 10 minutes or so. Now it's applying the changes. It's completed. Let's close it. Let's once again try to access our phone's internal storage using FTP. This time we are able to access it without getting the FTP folder error. So this was one way to solve the FTP folder error. If you liked the information then, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your time and patience. Have a nice day.